How do you handle sensitive or unexpected findings that may have implications beyond the heart? So beyond the, you know, okay, you don't pass heart. They go where you know, no, no, no. Okay. First of all, like you said, it's sensitive. So mm. um, breaking this um, sensitive news to to patients can also be challenging in itself. Mm. So um, sometimes patients don't want to hear the bad news. Mm -hmm. But then you try as much as possible to break it to them in a very palatable way. And then both of you <laughs> How are... How can it be palatable? <laughs> That's why you try. Oh, wow. That's why you try. Wow. So it might not seem... Pa the news itself might not be palatable, but mm. then the way you arrive at breaking the news, at least you start with the good news. The good news is that you are still alive. <laughs> and that you came to the hospital and then there is hope for you. Mm. But then the bad news is that you have to take some precautions and mm. um, you have to live with this for the rest of your life. Mm. Not that you are alone in this, mm. but we are here to support you every step of the way. So that way it comes off a little easy and the person is relaxed and knows that you are there for him or her. Mm. 